What's going on everybody, it's a YouTube troll, aka Papa Birdo, and I'm here to make this commentary to tell you guys a few things about Revolution, and about me in general, okay? And no, it's not personal things or anything like that, but I wanted to talk about what I'm planning on doing once the Revolution demo comes out, once the actual game comes out, so on and so forth. But first, I wanted to say that I'm, I'm hoping that I can play with a lot of my subs, I'm hoping that I can make enough videos for you guys to enjoy, maybe do first to threes in Revolution as well. And my other plan is to, you know, first learn the basics of the game, because I know they changed a lot of stuff, they polished a lot of stuff as well. Now, I'm going to be using the Awakening type mostly for when Revolution comes out, and on the demo as well. Because the thing is, guys, I, I, I agree with one of my subscribers that commented a long time ago about the Awakenings. Um, he said that awakenings are are meant for making comebacks or catching up or you know to somebody that has a lead on you with health. Maybe maybe your opponent has a lot of health and you you can awaken and kind of just close that gap a little. And I believe his YouTube name was like S Tiger's Prank. And I do agree with him. I do agree with him for Revolution on Storm Three. People use that shit just to abuse it. They don't really want to use it to uh, have that whole close the gap mentality you know what i'm saying so um that's about it for the awakening but that's mainly what i'm going to be using for revolution now given us how we're probably going to be seeing a, a good amount of different play styles in revolution i wanted to tell you guys that my goal my personal goal is to train uh on the game and improve you know and, I, and i'm gonna try to adapt my mindset for the game i'm gonna try to adapt the way i play for example man like, if I see that ranked is turning into something where, like, everybody's trying to use OP shit, that's what I'm going to use. Like, I'm going to legit go, you know, quote-unquote meta how people are putting it. By the way, I wanted to quickly just add on to this. People that talk about meta on Storm 3 have the word twisted up, okay? Because I believe in meta for every other game besides Naruto. Because Naruto is not a polished game, it's not a balanced game, and... It just gives people an excuse to abuse as much shit as possible. For example, when Minato had that invincibility frames every time he did LBRB, um, eh, you know, the Hanzo tilt, let's see, Awakenings, let's see what else, um, the U3 glitch. I do the U3 glitch, but I only do it on people that play me a certain way, if you know what I mean. Now, just to tell you guys, I, I do believe in meta, just not on Storm 3. Okay, because people have that fucking meaning of meta twisted up on that game, and I don't approve of that. But that's just my opinion, and I'm gonna keep it that way. Okay, I'm just trying to let you guys know that I don't believe in that shit for Storm 3. Now, for Revolution, I might change my mind, and I will see how they actually did polish the game because it does look like they did a lot of improvements. Um, what else? Okay, what else? Um, Oh yeah, for the videos, I'm planning on doing online commentaries, I'm planning on maybe doing duo comms, maybe with Mike, uh, or you know, just play with Keno, play with Mike, or and play with Rikudo. I'll try to play with a bunch of people and record that, because I want to play with different types of people, I guess, in order to get good too. And since Kakashi's gonna be in the demo, Kakashi being one of my mains next to Hashirama and Roji, I plan, since I don't think they're gonna have the first Okaga there, Obviously, um, I'm planning on just using Kakashi and maybe learning a few things about the mechanics, about how to play, you know, etc, etc. And I, I actually have like a few videos rendering right now that I'm planning on uploading by tomorrow. I have about three videos, I'm only going to upload two. And then, you know, pretty much I have enough videos to last me until the demo comes out. And I'm going to upload them uh, maybe one by one so that way uh, for when the demo comes out, I can record new footage and then upload it. But anyways, guys, that's really all I wanted to talk about, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary, which I doubt, but regardless, leave a like if you enjoyed it, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm out. Peace.